I am so excited. I am just leaving my doctor's office and I have um, <clears throat> really, um, I got really positive uh, feedback from him and I am so excited. I am so happy, uh, so relieved. Um, thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. I am so, so happy. Um, we still have some work to do, but um, I got some some positive feedback. And uh, yeah, uh, I'm going to drive home now. I'm too excited. I don't even know what to say. I'm just so happy. Anyway, we'll talk later. I am too excited. I can't even like, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. I don't know how to put it into words, my excitement. I'm just so excited. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Yes. Okay, let's go home. So I have not picked up the camera at all since I got back from the doctors. I've been, you know, doing things around the house. I decided to take down all the Christmas decorations today and pack everything away. So I've been focused on that. And then I had to do some things with my daughter that, um, school stuff that I needed, that I needed to do that I didn't get to do, um, this morning because I had my doctor appointment. Um, and now I'm about to go do my workout, which I have been, Honestly, I have been procrastinating for like the last hour and a half, maybe two hours. I was like, maybe I'll take today as my rest day, but I'm like, no, like I had such great news from the doctor and I'm doing so good. I don't want to like procrastinate. I'm just going to get it done. And then I also like to take Sundays off as my rest day. So in order for me to do that, I have to make sure I get my workouts done during the week. Um, what else? Um, oh yeah. And I also got this Thing in the mail that I don't think I've shared on here because that was like a last minute thing that I decided to do at the end of the year I think it was like on the 30th or the 31st like early early the 31st is like midnight maybe the midnight the 31st that I decided to do it um, or to join is this challenge it's called um, run the year I believe and um, this year is 2020 so um, the challenge is you run the you run 2020 miles for 2020 um, the whole year and it started January 1st I forget the name of the challenge that you know whoever the create whoever creates the challenge or who's hosting the challenge i think it's called run the edge i don't remember exact name but i'm gonna open the package because i just got it and that kind of gave me like the extra motivation to get my workout done this uh today um so i'm gonna go open the package i'm gonna show you guys and then we also have thor visiting us hi thor say hi say hi oh are you cozy are you cozy on the couch? Huh? Are you the cutest boy? Are you a handsome boy? Are you cozy? Yeah? <laughs> what a good boy. What a good boy. What a good boy. He's so comfortable. He's so comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> so this is it. This is who's hosting the challenge. Run the year. Uh, actually. This is the name of the challenge, uh, Run the Year. And I think it's hosted by Run the Edge. Uh, now I can't open it. Now I can't open it. But they give you this cool t shirt. <laughs> see if I can open it. I uh, can't do this with one hand. Here's my t shirt that goes with the challenge. Um, oh. I have this okay. cool coloring thing. <laughs> As you start to do miles, you color in the spaces until you get to 2020. Um, you can sign up to do the whole 2020, or you can do 500, you can do 1,000, 1,500, or the whole thing. And they also sent me this, which is the metal that goes with it, since it's a virtual thing. Um, and then each um, key as you complete um, the miles you insert it this one's 500 you turn it around it's a thousand 
And then this one is 1500 and then the finisher, finisher, which if you did 2020, you did, you do the finisher and take a picture, I guess. Or if you only signed up to do 500, then obviously you do 500 and then you can take a picture of the finisher. It's however many you signed up to do. Um, then what else they give me? Oh, they gave me this coin. I don't know if you guys can see it. Do, 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 do. It says commitment one year, legacy member year one. And then um, it says on the, on the other side, run the year commitment. I know the lighting isn't great um, here, but um, yeah, um, according to what I've seen on the Facebook group that they have, um, this is kind of like to, for you to keep with you, like in your pocket or somewhere to kind of remind you of your commitment and to stay active, you know, uh, what else? They gave me a little sticker, another sticker, and then, what is this? oh, this is just explaining how to use this. And what is this? Oh, and then this little note card is just says write a message to your to your future self to be read on December thirty first, twenty twenty. Um, and then this one where it just says you know you, you challenge accepted and you sign in and you date it. Um, but yeah, I've been doing this since the first of um the year uh, since January 1st and uh, I am super excited that I finally got my packet in yay <laughs> okay hopefully the lighting is a little bit better over here um look at Thor are you cozy mister are you cozy <laughs> he's so cute my daughter is practicing downstairs with her skates. I don't know if I said that before. So it's super loud. That's the, all that noise that you hear. Um, anyway, I decided to join kind of late. That's why I signed up. I think it was, I think I uh, found out about it like on the 30th sometime during, you know, sometime on the 30th around there. And then finally I was thinking about it, thinking about it. And then um, the 31st, we stay, I stayed up late. My husband had to work late. So we stayed up late and um, I was talking to him about it. And I'm like, I don't know. I don't know if, I don't know if I should do it uh, and he's like yes do it why not give it a go so I did I like I was like okay we're already in bed and I like signed up right then and there um, and that's why I'm just getting my packet now but um, yeah I didn't know about it I, I found out through um, this uh, this other mom that's part of a homeschool group that we uh, attend and she had posted about it on her Facebook and I didn't really know what it was all about. For some reason in my mind, I thought, she kind of like just, um, she shared a link about it and asked if some, if who wanted to join her to kind of create a team. But I wasn't sure exactly like the details. I didn't even click on the link at first. I just saw that it said like, 2020 but for some reason i was thinking that it was maybe like a 5k or something <laughs> and i was like sure right away i was like sure i'm all in and i thought it was we were supposed to run it like on january 1st you know to kind of kick off the year and it wasn't until later when she sent me more details i was like whoa wait a minute to 2020 means i have to run or walk you don't have to run but you know run or walk 2,000 miles and what 20 2020 miles in one year like what I started like doing like the math in my head I'm like what how many miles do I have to do and that's kind of like why I was hesitant because I didn't want to like sign up and then I don't um, what if I don't reach the goal and all that stuff you know all those doubts in your mind after I discussed it with my husband uh, he was like well if you don't make it it's okay but at least it was gonna motivate you even if you did 500 miles or a thousand miles like that's so a lot like that's a good accomplishment so don't be thinking about the I'm not gonna make it or it's a lot you know like just go for it and 
he knows that I love do doing these kinds of things. So he's like, yeah, you've been wanting to get back to running and, you know, being more active. You're already doing it. So might as well, you know, be part of something. Um, and so, yeah, then I was like, okay, fine, I'm going to do it. So I joined. And when I first joined, I went and I signed up and everything. I thought it was we each one of us as a team because she wanted my friend or this other mom wanted to create a team. And so I thought that as a team or each person in the team had to do the whole 2000 miles. Um, but you don't like if you have a team, then you can do 20, 20 miles, uh, or 2020 miles as a team. You can also do 2020 miles on your own if you want to, but as an individual, you can have a different goal. So I was like, okay, that kind of like let off a little bit of the pressure that I was feeling. Um, and I was like, oh, okay, I see. Okay, so just to kind of like not overwhelm myself, um, I uh, once you sign up and everything, you can log into kind of like your dashboard that you're going to be using for the year. You can. Um, uh, what's it called sync your uh, I think your Fitbit or if you have an Apple watch um, and then there's like another app that you can sync. there's like two or three different apps that they support and that way you don't have to manually in, um, put in all your miles you can have it synced directly uh, or automatically so I went and I did all of that and then it asks you if you're gonna commit to doing the 2020 miles or as an individual and as a team or if you want to have a different um, goal as an individual than as a team so I kind of was like okay what should I do so I decided to set it to a thousand miles as my personal goal. Of course, I'm gonna try to get as close, if not get to the 2020 miles on my own too, but just kind of like to get a little bit of the pressure off that I was feeling at first. I, um, I was like, I think this is gonna make this is gonna be good. I'll set it to a thousand, a thousand miles is totally doable. Um, so that's what I'm doing. <laughs> All that to say that that's what I'm doing. I'm committed to doing at least a thousand miles individual goal. And then as a team, we're doing the 2020 miles. And um, today is the 8th of January. I have I haven't checked on my phone today but I think as of yesterday I have about 30 miles 30 point something miles on my own and then as a team we have a little bit over a hundred miles already and then there is I believe there's four of us on the team and yeah I'm super excited I'm motivated um, I'm always walking and um, I don't do a, I haven't been doing a lot of running, but the last, since I started on the first, I have been little by little adding more um, running time to, um, instead of just walking, when I get on the treadmill, um, I used to just walk, but I'm slowly incorporating a little bit of running, and yeah, yesterday I was able to run a little bit more than walking, instead of just walking the whole time. Uh, but yeah, I don't know if all this makes sense, but I'm super excited and I wanted to share and kind of like also for accountability, obviously. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm going to, how I'm going to share that. Um, if maybe every time I hit a certain milestone, I don't know if it's like every 50 miles or every 100 miles. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Maybe I'll share it just as I go to let you guys know how many miles I have so far. I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I wanted to share it. And if you're doing this um, run the year challenge, let me know and let's do it together. Yay. Okay, now <laughs> off to do my workout and then to get some miles in because I haven't done any miles today. I haven't done my workout yet. And so I definitely have to do that. So let's do it.
I just finished, but I have to go run upstairs real quick because they're gonna pick up Thor. He was only here for a few hours while his um, owners went to dinner. So I'll be back. Okay, I am back. Um, I just had to go upstairs because they were, as I was finishing my, uh, my run, Thor's mommy said that she was on her way. She was like around the corner from here. So I'm like, I ran upstairs. I didn't want to be all sweaty. I was like dripping sweat. I grab a towel and I put it around me, <laughs> wiped out all the sweat. Anyway, um, that was three miles that I did. Normally I don't like to do like right now that I'm starting to get back to running it. Well, I'm not running. I'm like walking, uh, a mix of walking and running. But right now that I'm getting back into it, I'm not like trying to like hurt myself and just do like, like five miles at a time um, so I'm trying to do like two miles in the morning and then two miles at night and I alternate between walking and running I was gonna do two miles but um, I feel really good I think it was a good thing that I didn't work out this morning because um, I, this morning when I got up, I felt pretty tired. Like I felt my body was tired. <laughs> um, my legs feel tired. So I think it was a good thing that I didn't work out early this morning because I think I probably wouldn't have done uh, more than the two miles that I, that I was planning to do um, if I would have done it this morning. Um, but I feel really good after I, I after I did um, my beach body workout. I went on the treadmill and I did three miles straight. Stay. Um, I'm trying not to get distracted, but I have my little one here by me, and she's doing all kinds of things, so she's like distracting me. Um, but yeah, I am super excited to do this challenge. And I think as of tonight, I might have. Don't do that. Don't distract me. She's trying Not to. Distracting. Yeah, you distracted me because you see, I'm having a hard time. I'm having a hard time remembering what I wanted to say. I have 35 miles. No, wait, how much? I don't know if this is. Usually, it takes a little while for for this thing to update, but let's see. As of right now, it's saying that I have 34 and a half miles, um, which I am assuming it includes today's three miles that I just did. Let me see. I'm trying to like refresh the app. And this is on the run the year app that they have to kind of keep track of how many miles you have. So yeah, I have 34.5 miles and um, just on my own and then my team as a team let's see how much we have where does it say it let's see. stats oh. stats da -da 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 -da. What hurt, Mama? don't worry my rib hurts sometimes depending on how I sit um, as of today we have 145.1 miles yay <laughs> and today is um, November 8th November 8th it's not November 8th what am I saying I think because I was saying November 18th um, today is January 8th so as a team we have 145.1 and as an individual I have 34.5 miles so far so that's good I, I think I'm doing good like I said I had I set my my, my goal for the year to, at a thousand so we'll see um, my next bib which they show you like every time you hit like a, a milestone or something I guess they tell you which bib you just got so um, my next individual bib is the 100 mile bib so yeah I am on my way I'm 65.48 miles away from my 100 mile bib yay 
today was a great day I am so happy I feel so blessed and so grateful um, God is so good um, I was so like beyond uh, grateful this morning uh, and feeling so so blessed I know I said that already but I felt so so blessed um, that I got really positive feedback from the doctor and um, yeah I'm still waiting on some some more results to come back and test that I yesterday I went and I did some uh, other testing that he wanted me to do and um, I don't know I just I feel so grateful I mean think that um, that everything so far is coming back okay and um, I think I did mention this morning that I still have some work to do which is um you know lose definitely lose um at least 20 pounds he wants to see me in four months and he's given me um four months to see how i'm feeling how i progress with my eating uh, my nutrition and losing some more weight and stuff like that um so i'm definitely committed uh, to doing that to making sure that i at least i am doing my part um, when it comes to my um, eating habits, getting those back in on track and um, getting myself working out and uh, losing weight. Um, but yeah, I'm super, super grateful um, that everything came back okay so far. Everything is great and I know I have faith that everything else is going to come back okay and that you know all these issues that I've been having, um are just you know minor things that i can fix with my uh you know nutrition eating healthier staying away from certain hey things. guys <laughs> it is um not the same day that i filmed this vlog that you guys are watching um but i as i am editing the vlog I realized that, um, or I remembered that my battery had died as I was still talking because as you can see in this vlog, I can talk a lot. I might not make sense, but I can talk. <laughs> anyway, so um, yeah, what um, I think what I was trying to say there at the end was that, um, you know, I'm just going to continue to stay positive and continue to do and have faith um and of course continue to follow this this these changes and follow through with these changes that i'm making getting back uh to a healthier lifestyle and um i have faith that as i make those changes all these aches and pains and ailments ailments i think that's the word but aches and pains that I've been experiencing the last um, couple of years will um, just disappear. So that's it. I just wanted to close the vlog because I realized I didn't close it, after, you know, after the, my battery died. But um, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog. I know it was very chatty. I hope that you guys watched till the end. <laughs> And I will um, keep you guys updated on my miles and see how I'm doing with that. And of course, with everything else, thank you so much for watching. Make sure that you subscribe to follow along my um, health journey and this new challenge that I'm doing. If you guys are doing this challenge, the run the year challenge, let me know in the comments below. If you guys are part of <clears throat> any group, part of, you know, like the run the year challenge there's several groups on facebook if you guys are part of any groups let me know and maybe we can motivate each other that way or you guys can follow me on instagram i'm always posting on there like daily on my stories <clears throat> not my feed i really don't post on my feed i post on my stories because <clears throat> sorry <laughs> i post on my stories more than on my feed because it's so much easier anyway here i am going on another tangent I am going to end it here. So yeah, let me know if you guys are doing it too. And let's motivate each other. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. See you guys next time. Bye.